It's time to Avada Kedavra, ev Avada Kedavra, everybody. Avada Kedavra! Oh! Oh! Oh, good. Oh, no. We haven't missed the sorting ceremony. Oh, no. I'm no expert, but... Are we good? That oh, no. seems more appropriate. Oh, no. Now, I need to study this locket as soon as I can, but first I must contact the Ministry. They need to know what happened to George and be warned of Ranrock. For the moment, I ask that you keep all that's happened this evening between you and me. Of course, sir. Thank you. Ready for the sorting ceremony? Frames dropped a little bit. Camera's lagging a tad. Sorry about this. If you're watching on YouTube, Phineas I literally Nigellus gave up playing Black. yesterday. And, uh... Ooh, Phineas Black. Prepare yourself to meet the headmaster. Fig, nice of you to join us. The sorting ceremony is over. There were complications. Complications? It seems the goblin Enough. problem has... Goblins. I've no time for rumors, Fig, and I'm rapidly losing whatever patience rumors. I have left. If you're lucky, we might still be able to get you sorted this evening. <clears throat> I'll be in touch. So if you're watching on YouTube yesterday, uh, well, what's happening now was happening all day. Um, for some reason, only my camera's lagging. Harry? Professor Weasley, we've one more to be sorted. Welcome. But yeah, You're yesterday my stream time. kept crashing. Have a seat. So here we are. Twitch on TV forward slash MRPG. Have a say hello. Half or path of other cadaver. There's no. Ah, yes. A bit older than the others, aren't you? Yes, I am. You come here with preferences and preconceptions. Certain expectations. I can't wait to explore. I'm looking forward to exploring Hogwarts and the world and beyond murdering the castle grounds. Mm, indeed. Much can be gleaned by having an adventurous spirit. But your professors have a great deal to teach you as well. Hmm, interesting. You've recently learned that you possess a rare ability. I detect a growing sense of ambition, an eagerness for power. Perhaps you belong in Slytherin. I like this guy. You know what? Perhaps I do. <laughs> One more thing. Due to the unfortunate injury on the pitch in last spring's final, this year's Quidditch season has been cancelled. Enough! It's not as though I've banned flying altogether. But don't tempt me. You are here to focus on your academic futures. I'm sure you will have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. I said, I'm sure you all have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. Quite an entrance. It's lovely to meet you. I'm... Professor Weasley, would you be so kind as to show our new student to their common room? I shall see to it, sir. As I was saying, I'm Professor Weasley. Pleased to meet you. Nice to meet you as well, Professor. As Deputy Headmistress, it is my distinct honour to show you to your common room. Right this way. It's quite uncommon for a student to begin as a fifth year. It may be a bit of a challenge, but one I'm sure you're up for. 
I can be quite resourceful. I suspected as much. This is the entrance to the Slytherin common room. In order to enter, one must simply speak the correct password. Aspiration. Very well. Aspiration. Well done. Now, go on in and get some sleep. You have a big day ahead of you tomorrow. I shall be back in the morning to collect you for your first class. Okay. Thank you, Professor Weasley. You're welcome. I hope you enjoy your first night at Hogwarts. Sleep well. We're just going to carry on. I'm going to try and keep my uh, hopes up and stuff, but bro, if it keeps happening, man, I think we just wait for like a patch or something. I don't know. It's definitely not my internet. Anyway, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, everyone. I don't know why this is happening, but uh, yeah, let's just carry on and hope it stops. Okay, try and, try and stay positive. I okay. suppose some introductions are in order. That new fifth year must be different. That new fifth year with awful internet. <laughs> Can I help you? It was exciting. It was dreadful, certainly, but quite an experience nonetheless. Interesting perspective. How did you and Fig manage to escape? It's all still a bit of a blur, to be honest. Didn't mean to press. You just get yourself settled. We can talk more later. What were you reading? What book were you reading? A spell book I picked up. Has a few interesting things, but not exactly what I was looking for. Sick the I'm sure you'll find oh, wait, out no, soon enough. Snape's. But not every spell you may need can be found in our assigned textbooks. See, this guy's talking my language. What do you mean? Are you saying some spells aren't taught at Hogwarts? Which ones? Seems Crucio, I may have met a kindred a spirit. Davra. <laughs> is it imperious? That is a conversation for another time. It was good meeting you. Good luck today. Is it Imperious? What's the last? Is it Imperious? The last spell? Revelio. Um, excuse me. You can't use Revelio in the common room. Shut up, nerd. Ooh. Imperio. That's the one. Let's be honest, that would be the most useful in real life. If you do that, you'll lose. Trust me. Oh, nerd. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, might want to think that again. Stop backseating! God, she really is a sliverin. <laughs> oh man, I'm gonna be the smartest sliverin in this whole school. <laughs> uh, who doesn't finish their apple? Uh, might want to think that again. Okay. How you doing? I'm Elder. The Elder Ugh, one. Not going to She's got here, it. Are you? Here, watch this. Don't say I didn't warn you. Get Check wrecked! It. Told you. Bro, she really is a Slytherin. Backseating him, rubbing it you in that he lost. Me? Oh, Glowing. I know who you are. You're the new Slytherin, the one who barged in with Professor Fig last night. Interesting tactic on your first day, yeah, taking all the attention before, away yeah. from the first years. I'm Amelda, by the way. Shame I wasn't with you and Fig. I could have lured that dragon away. Oh my, my god, she's a know-it-all as well. God, I look cool. I wish you had been there. Is what a tier 3 sub would say, I would never. We had it handled. Fool! We handled it. And I think you're underestimating the nature of a dragon. A broom would have been kindling. <laughs> <laughs> Not the way I fly. Perhaps one of these days I'll show you a thing or two about flying. I can teach you more than Kagawa ever could. 
Speaking of which, I'd like to get in some time on my broom before classes. Look at my evil look. Uh, my guy actually looks evil, right? Do you fly a lot? Yeah, great question. Man, have you ever, heard, have you ever noticed how in RPGs, they just make you sound like the dumbest guy? Anyway. Do, do, do you fly? Do you have a lot of time to fly during school? Oh, I make the time. Enough. There's nothing like swerving through the spires of the castle and around the Quidditch pitch to clear the mind. Clear the mind of what? Evil thoughts? Those are good for you. You seem to know a lot about chess. Are you a keen wizard chess fan? You knew that boy was going to lose the match. Not really. Much too sedate a pastime for me. Also, it's simply not that challenging. The moves are always so obvious. Why does no one else see it? Okay. I think my character's in love. Goodbye, Imelda. Nice meeting you. This may be our, like, Bonnie and Clyde of, like, taken over the world. We shall see. All right, I'm Elder. I really hope <laughs> Sorry. Okay. This guy's standing, staring at people whilst leaning against the wall in a cool way. I really hope we get to Very see Very ominous. <laughs> I think I heard one. Hmm. Doubt mermaids find us that interesting. Ah, oh, oh, based yeah. Based on all the chatter when you entered the common room, I'm guessing you're. This is the one who's. Here. I'm pretty sure is blind. I'm ominous. Ominous gaunt. Nice to meet you, ominous. Well, you certainly had a memorable arrival. I do like to make an entrance. Well, if I'm going to make my mark here, I had to start right away. <laughs> You're definitely in the uh -huh. right house. Do let me know if I can be of any help as you navigate your first days here. I don't I need help. Need it. Exactly. Did you suspect you'd be in Slytherin? Were you expecting to be sorted into Slytherin? Most certainly. My family on my father's side are direct descendants of Salazar Slytherin, one of the four founders of Oh, he of was a great man. Not something I'm especially proud of, mind you. He was obsessed with blood status. A pure blood maniac. As he should Unfortunately, be. Unfortunately, most of his descendants do not fall far from that tree. Good. Are you insinuating you don't like pure bloods? Foolish Slytherin. So, uh, you see a lot of mermaids around here. Did that student say he thought he heard a mermaid? <laughs> yes, but I've never heard of a mermaid showing up outside our common room window. It is fun to play along, though. Been known to keep some first years on the lookout. My for middle hours. name's based. Nice. To, well, it wasn't nice meeting you, actually, but I guess I met you. Thank you, Ominous. Very nice to meet you. Pleasure was all mine. Don't be a stranger. Why does it make our? Ca you know what? I'm starting to There's wish. Is fifth year Slytherin in here? Professor Weasley's waiting for you just by the stairs. Oh, please, anything but that vile woman. Every time she shows up on my screen, like, she just breaks my OBS. Please. Yes, Professor Weasley, those filthy Gryffindor scum. All right. So one annoying thing about the game is, uh, it makes my uh, OBS break. That's one annoying thing. And the other is I wonder if it would have been better to have a silent protagonist. Maybe for a streamer it would have been because I can like, you know, rebut. But like, he's, he's saying stuff that a Slytherin wouldn't say. Well, maybe we haven't been fully corrupted yet. Good. As a Slytherin should, do not share your sweets with nobody. Eat them all for yourself and enjoy them, sir. Alright. Now, we've got some important shit to do. <laughs> Alright, sorry. Okay. Uh, can we get a breakdown of the story? So, we are a fifth year student that haven't done the first four years. So, And it's definitely not because we're slow. Um, I don't know why we didn't do the first four years. I don't think it's been announced yet. I can't remember if it has been. Um, but basically, we started the game with a guy called Fig and Georgie 
Georgie gave Fig a cool key that when we touched it turned out to be a port key, but Georgie got killed because he got eaten by a dragon. We took the port key to some area, and it happens to be an area that is full of ancient magic that only I can see, for I am the chosen one who can see ancient magic. Um, we passed the test of like all the ancient magic stuff, met an evil goblin who was evil, and uh, yeah, and now we're at Hogwarts. Oh, and we're in Slytherin House, as we should be. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is a roundup of the game. Oh, and this game destroys my frames into the Shadow Realm. Hopefully no more, though. We shall see. I knew it! Hmm. This must be from the year of the maidenless realms. Hmm. Yes, as you can see, this is definitely from the mage Miyazaki-san's... <laughs> this is kind of... <sighs> Good morning. I trust you're ready for your first day at Hogwarts? I don't know, I've maybe if you stop breaking my game. Time. Can't believe I'm here. Well, you are here. Make the most of it. You only have one first day at Hogwarts. Now, in light of your unique okay. situation, joining us as a fifth year, you'll need to catch up with your classmates and not fall behind. Especially as you'll be expected to complete your OWLs at the end of the year. OWLs? Owls? Yes, your ordinary wizarding level exams. They will determine what type of career you can have when you leave here. After much discussion with the Headmaster and the Department of Magical Education at the Ministry, we've devised something extraordinary to ensure your success. Hey. Here you are. Can I at least have some fun first? You're already making me study? Cool. What is it? It is a wizard's field guide. It will help you to keep track of what you are learning so that you master all that's expected of a fifth year. You would be wise to take full advantage of this exceptionally valuable resource. Thank you, Professor, but what do you mean it will keep track of what I'm learning? Perhaps seeing it in action will answer any questions you may have. Walk with me and we shall put it to the test. Oh. God, This you... way. Where's the leader of Slytherin House? Why is this... I love how I we just... I certainly would have appreciated something like the field guide when I was a student. Yeah, Using you... the guide will also train you to be alert to your surroundings. It's because you're a stupid Weasley. All right. I really hope our character gets a little bit more personality. Do you know what I mean? Because, like, he just saw this book, like, open up into some badass, and he just goes, What is it? <laughs> <laughs> like, at least he should have said, Cool, or blind me, or something, man. Um, okay. Slytherin dungeon. <laughs> the guide will give you opportunities to practice your magic and educate yourself about wizarding law. Ooh, Do look keep at that up. chest. And look at that chest. <laughs> Why don't you cast Revelio on that statue? And see what details the field guide can provide. Uh, Madam Weasley, there's a... There's a... There's a chest giving me the evils. Are we gonna... Are we... The stat... The statue is the last of our worries here, ma'am. There's a chest side-eyeing me right now. And I'm being judged. 
I suddenly feel like I have a spot on my head or something. You know what? And now it's squinting. Now it's looking at me sussy. Ma'am, there's a chest looking at me sussy. Okay, we're just going to ignore the chest looking at me sussy. Okay, ma'am, there's a chest looking at my balls. <laughs> and I can't do anything. Abracadabra! <laughs> okay. Well, just ignore that chest. That's now staring at my ass. All right. What did she want again? Revelio! Oh, cool. This statue depicts the Kelpie, a shape-shifting water demon native to Ireland and Great Britain, which usually takes the form of a long-maned horse. The largest Kelpie ever reported is the Loch Ness Monster in SCOTLAND! You just unlock the Field Guide Challenge. Your progress towards completing challenges appears here. Field Guide Challenges are the only way to acquire XP. Or XP. Right. This is your wizarding level XP earned from challenges increases. XP earned from challenges. Man, full stops are important. XP earned from challenges increase increases your level and power. Your field guide tracks your current challenge progress. Select the challenges menu to continue. No, I shan't. I'll go on then. Cool. I already love this. Collecting your first guide page unlock the new challenge category. New challenges you unlock throughout your adventure will appear here. Select field guide pages to continue. So we've got... Spoilers, man! Come on, man! Why would you spoil your own game that the room of requirements going to be in it? Come on, Porky Games. Put a question mark on there. Just make this a question mark. That's all you have to do. Anyway, discover field guide pages around the world. Uh, what is that? A bald Harry Potter? What the hell's going on? Each challenge has tiers. Special rewards unlock at each tier you complete, from appearances to critical upgrades. Rewards must be claimed from the challenges menu. Come back often. Okay. Cool. Seems pretty easy enough. Oh, are we? Clever, isn't it? Keep your eyes open for more opportunities like that inside and outside of the castle. Ma'am, there's an opportunity. Okay, this, 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 that. All right, let's look at the statue first. Oh, shit. Are we just going to ignore this bloody... What the hell is this? Oh, cool. Okay, I'm not spoiling the... the I'm not spoiling none of these. I don't want to know what any of them are. Hey, Taser. Uh, the, the, yes. If anyone's just joined us, there is a chest looking at us sussy right now. I don't know why, and we can't do anything to it. Um... Uh... Yes, Taser. Precisely. Do it real quick. Do what? I can't do anything to the chest. Okay, I guess all the NPCs got... Okay. Law? Ah! Good timing. Perfect opportunity to show you how to use flu flames to get around a bit quicker. Oh, Your awesome. field guide contains a map of the castle. Open it up and find Central Hall. You can open a map at any time to fast travel to any discovered flu flames. Cool! Oh! That is... Quidditch question mark 
Hogwarts is divided into two main areas. The left side of the map is where students and professors live and includes the house, common rooms and the Great Hall. Okay, so left side, common rooms, Great Hall. Gotcha. Oh my god, there's no shot we're going to the Grand Staircase. Okay, the worrying thing is I'm only seeing six spots. Um, now, the only reason I say that's a little bit worrying is, isn't that, isn't the, isn't that kind of small? Well, well I could, oh wait, nope, when we click on that, it looks like there's tons of other little ones. Okay, okay, I get it, I get it. There's tons of like little ones. Oh, you, can you rotate? No, you can't. You can zoom in though. Which is cool. No rotating yet, maybe later. All right. To the grand staircase. In this view, you can see the flue flames available in that region. Okay, so this game is quite big. Holy crap. Uh, green flue flames represent flames you've discovered. And white ones... Okay, okay. Return to the map. The right side of the map is where you'll find academic points of interest. Astronomy tower, library, and greenhouses. Select the library annex region to continue. Professor Weasley has unlocked the central hall flu flames for you. Use R to rotate the map and fast travel to the central hall flu flame. Oh, now you can rotate. There we go. Interesting. Cool. Let's travel, ladies and gentlemen. And here we are. Quite the time saver. These stairs lead directly to Central Hall. Oh my god. You can get almost anywhere in the castle quickly from Central Hall. Bro. Chat, we're in frickin' Hogwarts. Like, we're actually in it. And look, it's me. Little did you guys know that I am a bard. It's actually me. I didn't want to spoil it, but that's the law. We were a bard, and we didn't make enough money. So, uh... It's time to go to school and become evil. Because the world revolves around money. For anyone, by the way, who's who's okay, well, I'm going to do this. I'm just letting you guys know. I am going to take everything in nice and slowly. If I see paintings that I want to look at, then I'm just going to look at paintings. Do you know what I mean? Like, yeah. Oh, my God. Always something happening here. It's the heart of the hive. Our King's Cross Station, so to speak. Revelio. I heard something. Okay, it's definitely that, the unicorn. Oh, wait. Oh, what's that? Okay. Oh, shit. Chat. What's it? Oh, okay. It's the flu system. Okay. Oh, I was excited. Okay. Oh, I just want to get this done so I could just explore. Okay. What's good, Alexander? That should be all for now. You'll be expected to attend both Charms and Defense Against the Dark Arts classes today. Nice! And I'd like to be sure you get to Hogsmeade as soon as possible to replace the supplies you lost on the way here. Oh shit, yeah, I don't have no clothes. What's Hogsmeade? Bro, haven't you read the books? <laughs> you mentioned Hogsmeade, Professor. Hogsmeade is the only all-wizarding village in Britain and is home to an array of shops and pubs. 
You should be able to find all of the school supplies you require in Hogsmeade. You will also, I imagine, enjoy many a butterbeer there with friends in due course. I don't need friends. Uh, what exactly is Defense Against the Dark Arts? Can you tell me more about the Defense Against the Dark Arts class? Right, there better be a Defense bogger Against in the this Dark game. Arts, as the name implies, focuses on how to defend oneself against the evils that lurk beyond these walls. Well, we ain't a mastery of Defense Against the Dark Arts them. is required for those who aspire to become auras. And that's the last Fortunately, thing I aspire to Fortunately, we be. are lucky to have the ever-gifted Professor Hecate in charge of our students' education in that regard. Professor Hecate. Well, what the heck, boy? Can you tell me more about the charms class? What will I learn in charms class? Exactly what you might expect. Spells, charms, jinxes. All terribly Our useful. Our character is so dumb. I think dumb. you will enjoy Professor Ronan. He's a clever and entertaining wizard. Exactly And truth. a talented teacher. What will we learn in charms class, Professor? Well, charms. <laughs> What, like the thing you put on key rings? Sure. Thank you, Professor Weasley. A lot to absorb on your first day, and you have much to learn. How dare Happily, you patronise me, filthy Weasley! To create additional assignments for you outside of class. You'll be up to speed in no time. Judging by your adept use of Revelio earlier, I'd say Professor Fig succeeded in at least showing you the basics. He He's taken the piss. He's been terribly vague as to the events preceding your arrival, specifically about what happened after that awful dragon attack. My suspicion is that there's more to the story than a You're search wrong, for belongings James. and an extended trip up to the castle. There's more to a story to the story than a search for belongings and an extended. Look at her trying to weasel her way in. Ain't no. I'm afraid there isn't. I'm sorry, Professor, but I'm afraid that's all there is to it. Hmm. Almost precisely what Professor Fig said. Oh, speak of the, speak devil. Of the devil. Professor Fig, your ears must have been oh burning. God, oh, Maya Weasley. Yes. You seem to have provided our new fifth year with a solid foundation in the. I basics swear I'm a sliverin. Ah, I'm afraid I can't take all the credit there, Professor. They were good, Novi. Aptitude for magic, it seems. Hmm. Well, I'm just glad you both arrived in one piece. The one Perfectly piece! Good boats and carriages to Hogwarts, and you chose to fly in the path of a dragon. I wouldn't say I chose the dragon's path, Professor. Rather unfortunately, it would seem that it chose us. Very well. Enough chit chat. I need to get to class myself. Off with you! Might I rely on you, Professor Fig, to explain the details of the field guide's map? Of course. Thank you. I don't trust Good her. Good luck today. Uh, uh, and remember to use your field guide. All right, Mrs. Weasley. Guide. It will be invaluable to you. I thought you had gone. And invaluable to me, as I'll be using it to keep up to date on your progress. Yes, Professor. Yeah. Come and find me in my classroom after you've attended both classes today, and I'll explain more about those assignments I mentioned. And we'll see if we can't get you to Hogsmeade for those supplies. She's so patronising, man. Uh, Verna Cadabra! <laughs> God, just missed her. All right, Professor Fig, what's good? Do I have to talk to you, or can I just... Can I just explore now? My older sister came here. Said she carved her initials into the fireplace of our common room. But I think she made it up. I bet garlic had a say in it. Why else would it be the only common room with plants? She's garlic? obviously showing favor. Garlic bread? I heard that someone cast the Confundus charm on a raven called Fourth Year, so they couldn't answer the riddle. He's a good man. I try to imagine the great witches and wizards of the past who once sat in <gasps> the same chairs as we now get to sit in, in the common room. Most inspiring. Are you? I think the Hufflepuff common room is the coziest of them all. Simply the fact that it's so close to the kitchens makes it seem more homely. Why would Helga Hufflepuff have you tap on barrels, though? That's the only thing that mystifies me. I suspect most Slytherins would prefer not to be in a dungeon myself. I... The chairs in the common room are too comfortable. I love the dungeons! I the other day. Woke up two hours after charms. 
Sometimes the prefect sits next to me. <sighs> well, one time they did. In the common room. Mind you, it was the only Who keeps time. moaning? And I did ask them to. If you ask any Hufflepuff, they'll tell you there's a badger in their common room. I tried to hide a puff scheme once. In the corner of the common room. Classic Ravenclaw just sounds depressed. It's always much too loud in the common room. Nothing worse. What is this slivering each other in the common room? Witch doing with this Gryffindor? Oh, the cadaver! Oh, okay. Ladies. Okay. Oh. Um, let's have a little look-see here at this statue. Okay, we've got some mermaids and we've got some dwarfs pissing on them. Oh, it's, uh, I mean, spitting out water. Sorry, I Where did you get your dragon hide gloves? I saw you handling that snuggle off in Herbology. You know my gloves went missing. Lumos. Missing. Hey, impressed, guys, right? Guys. The rate you're going, right. you'll need a calm interrupt. Revelio. Just finding secrets. Don't mind me, ladies. This ornate fountain features intricately carved statues of denizens of the magical world, including a set of stone sirens encircling the fountain's base. 